Hello, and welcome to my cash shop. How can I help you? Aren't you the pawn shop guy? I thought Jack Gordon owned this place. He took the weekend off. I'm filling in. Don't worry about it. Now, what are you looking for? Well, I just think it's finally time that I grab myself a set of wheels. My dad never taught me how to drive, and I feel like it's time that I learned. Eh, uh, yeah, about that. We ain't got any cars. What? No cars? But I heard that they were supposed to be out by now. I was really looking forward to driving one. Hey, you're preaching to the choir here, lady. <sighs> this is so dumb. A lotto auto? More like no auto at all. Oh. Very clever. Thanks. Eh, tell you what. I may not have any cares, but I do have free Newscape Pro subscriptions. Did you say free? I'll take eight. Well, you only really need one. Oh. Okay, one please. Back off. You don't want to mess with me. Oh, but I do. Come on, girlie. Let's tango. Not today. Fade? Jules, get out of here. No, I can help you. It isn't safe here for you anymore. Run, I've got this. Okay. Be careful. She can run, Fade, but she'll only die tired. I won't let you touch her. <laughs> Boy's got a crush, huh? Tell you what, I'll leave pretty corpses so they can bury you together. Not if I bury you first. Welcome to my world. <sighs> well. All right, then. Need trick. What's wrong? Are you scared? No, but you should be. Oh, why you? Oh, it's on now. Boo. Huh? Ah. Not him up. Not so fast. Ah, that's it. Time to throw down. Ah. No. Ah. Ah. You're outmatched. Is that so? Then it's time I even the odds. This seems fair. No. Fair. Wrong. For once, I agree with you. Until next time, Fade. Sorry you got roped into all of this, home. How long do you think they'll keep us in here? That's reassuring. Hello, Jules. You. What do you want? I... I, uh... I came to apologize. Huh? Really? Yeah, I acted too rashly before. I have a habit of doing that. Not to make excuses, but my family has a history of being pretty hot-headed. Sure. Okay. Anyways, I talked to Meowsles, Cameo, Kit, pretty much everyone. You don't belong in a cell. Even after what you did to Skye. She attacked- I know, I know. <sighs> I love Skye. But I realize now that she's not the same person anymore. She's been gone for so long. It was naive of me to believe she hadn't changed. I understand. Once you have an image of someone in your head, it's hard to shake it. Which is why I locked you up in the first place. Some authority lackey comes traipsing around like she owns a place after she stabbed my girl. Nah. I'm not just some lackey, but... My point is, I'm sorry. And I hope you accept it as sincere. <sighs> 
I do, Rox. Thank you. Now, um, I have to clear it with Turk before we process you out. He's trying to make the Fortilla agency level efficient, which really means bureaucratic red tape. So sit tight until the morning, okay? Can do. That, uh, that went better than expected. What the? Fade? Jules, come on, let's get you out of here. How'd you know where to find me? I intercepted a message from that assassin droid. Once I saw what they had done to you, I knew I had to help. Fade, I really appreciate the gesture, but I think it's best if I stayed here. Wait, you want to stay cooped up in this cell? Uh, it's kind of hard to explain. Hmm, all right then. Would you like some company? I'd like that. Pieces are almost in place. Soon, Ghost will be no more. Nah, it's not. Uh. Deadeye, I was wondering where you had slinked off to. I had to do some research into... Into... Well, the dark arts. No, you can keep that magic mumbo-jumbo to yourself. I prefer science. Oh, and is science what did that to your face? Touche. Jules was able to escape from us, but not for long. I have it on good authority that she's hiding out at the Fortilla, to no one's great surprise. Heck, I could have told you that. Regardless, it seems all of our enemies are gathered there, and it's about time we wipe them out. You're talking to foul on Purge, huh? What's the matter? Does that not align with your morals? No, it's just gonna cost you extra. Rise and shine, and taste that freedom. Mm-hmm. Fade? Huh? Nothing. You said freedom? I believe he did! Ah, it feels so good to be out of that cell. Sorry it took so long. Hey, if you were the authority, you would have kept us in there forever. I welcome the speediness. Yeah, thanks, Meowsles. I know you did your best. I'm happy to hear you say that. I still feel bad about how it all went down, but... But Skye's touched a lot of people's hearts, I know. Is she... still... Yeah, we don't know if she'll be waking up anytime soon. I'm sorry. It's not something you should worry about. Come on, let's get you out of this place. Free at last! Oh, I cannot wait to see Kit! Don't push your luck. It feels so good just to walk around. I'm sure you can't wait to stretch those wings. I wonder where Fade went. Did you miss me? <laughs> Don't do that again, okay? Sure. And yeah, I didn't hear you leave last night. I felt like it may have been strange for ghosts to find another prisoner in their cell. You're probably right about that. You could have left a note, though. Worried I wouldn't come back? Maybe a little. Jules. Fade. What was that? Sounds like someone's in trouble. Come on. Huh? Is this real? It's real. Jenny, I love you. Will you? Oh my god. Okay, go. Keep going. Uh, will you do me the honor of marrying me? <laughs> Is that a yes? Yes, Abel! It's a yes! Oh, of course I'll marry you! Jenny, I can't believe this is finally happening. <laughs> Neither can I. I love you. I love you. Oh, wow. That sure was something, huh? Yeah. So, so anyways, anyways, I should go. go. Yeah, see you around, Jules. See ya, Fade. <sighs> what a day.